Hi, this is Mahi. Today I'm gonna practice some coding uh, and use Python for connecting to simulator and work with the simulator. Uh, so first, as you see in the last tutorial, we are on the simulation application here. We don't mind this windows for this tutorial because we don't want to use the GUI for connecting to the robot. We're gonna use the uh, Python program API. So I run a PyCharm to connect to the to write the Python script and read the Python script. So as you can see, there is a project that uh, this is a simplest real project that we cloned. It has many folders. The folder and the directory that you should focus on is the client directory. In the client directory, because other is to help the simulator to run, you don't. It doesn't matter. But there, this is the where you should write your code. You can write it in a Scratch. You can write it in CPP or Python. Uh, in the Python, we have many example code. Uh, one that you should care about is the sample.py. This is a sample code that you can run and test your uh, robot with it. And understand this code is enough for you and maintaining this code is enough for uh, participating in the competition. So for running your code, you need to run actually two other Python script, but the code you written here will be run. Okay, so it's very simple. The first script that you should uh, run is the client.py. As you can see, there's a main function here, so I need to run it. And at the first of this file, we said my player is sample. Now I import the sample file here. So because of this, whatever code you written in the sample will be executed. You can say my player is player. So I comment this line and I uncomment this line. So you can see my player changed to this file. So now my code, uh, so now the client use the player code. So you can have as many as a script, as many as a strategy you want here. And you can select them only by import the script here and uh, just assign the script to my player. So I'm going to start with the sample script. And uh, maybe in future tutorials, we go to the player script. So I run the client. The client is running. The client is the application that cannot directly connect to the simulator. So we need a proxy server here to translate the client message to what the VRIP simulation software, this software, understands. This script, this Python script, is the server.py. So after you run the client.py, you need to run the server.py that transfer your message to VRIP simulator. Now you can see that the client code is working. And this robot is moving in this field. It was good. So I stop the simulator. And no. So I just wrap it up this session. And I'm going to just uh, do all of the things we did here one more time, but very fast. So first, you need to run the simulator. Second, you need to run a client. So yeah, the simulator is running. I can ask the robot to look at other directions. And you need to run the client first, the client code. And after that, you need to run the server code. So it's done. Now the robot is playing the game. Time is passing. And your robot is moving. This is a simple code that we put for you to understand the minimal concept of these robots and this game. Uh, this robot is uh, just trying to achieve to moving further in the maze and exploring the area. Uh, find as much as label and character or plate as you can. So you can see in this video.